Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to install Google Optimize on your Shopify or Shopify Plus store in less than two minutes. Don't hold me to the two minutes though. All right, we're in Google Optimize. We're going to uh, go to Install Optimize here. We're going to copy this little snippet and head on over to your Shopify admin under Preferences, Google Analytics, and then you'll see this additional uh, JavaScript setting. Just copy that in there and save. And we'll move on to step two. So the next step is our page hiding snippet. So this helps reduce that flicker that you'll see on some sites when it's loading and then it flickers and reloads. That's the, the A-B test that uh, is usually changing out for some users. We are actually going to put this all the way at the top. I should have said copy this. And then we're going to go into your store, themes, your theme liquid. So this is the template that loads on every single page, unless you have custom pages, but for the most part, you should be good just copying it at the top here. All we need to do is just copy that page hiding snippet at the top here, and then save. Now we are going to go back to Shopify, or excuse me, optimize, and go into our draft test, and you'll see this little diagnostics. So we're gonna run the diagnostics, which will open up your website and you'll see optimize is correctly installed which is great that's exactly what we're looking for uh, you can also use the GA tag assistant that'll show you if optimize is working properly um, if you do come across errors or warnings like your allow linker is not set and you have Google Tag Manager running then you might need to go to your Google Analytics variable uh, inside of Google Tag Manager and then go to fields to set, add field, allow linker, set that to true and save and then rerun your verification on Optimize. But uh, that's it. It's super simple. I am ready to start testing on this amazing demo store that will have a 0% conversion rate. If you have any questions, problems, please leave them in the comments. Thanks so much and happy testing.